Thank you very much. Robert Meacham, uh, one of the many stars on offense for the New Orleans Saints tonight. Guys, uh, first let's talk about uh, the hat, division champs. That's a good feeling, isn't it? Great feeling. Um, that's something we came in in training camp talking about what we wanted to do. Um, it's win a division. That was our first goal. We accomplished it. You didn't just beat Atlanta. You uh, you know blew them out of the building for the most part in this ball game. Just talk about what you learned from that first game that you took to tonight's game. Well, we just learned that we can't make no mistakes. Um, the mistakes that we did make, we had to capitalize off of it. And our defense uh, got turnovers, and it helped. All right, Drew Brees now breaks Dan Marino's single-season passing record. You're on this offense. Uh, you can tell your grandkids about this one day, right? Yes, you know, this is going down in history. I'm glad to be a part of it. Talk about the way the game evolved, though. It looked like he was going to break in the third quarter, then Sproles brings it back, and then Jenkins gets a touchdown, and then you had to punt. Did, it, did you guys press a little bit trying to get him the record after that? No, we didn't press. But nobody ever talked about the record. Um, we just wanted to win. And if he'd have got the record today or next week, it wouldn't have mattered to us as long as he got it. Just talk about what, what it was like when he gets the mark, uh, the timeout, the fans are going crazy, you guys are hugging him on the sidelines. That was a great scene for this football team, wasn't it? It was a great moment, not just for our fans and not just for him, but for everybody, for the whole organization. Talk about what he means. I mean, what makes him so rare? I mean, not only the records, but the way he kind of takes everybody's side. When you were a rookie, I know you told me he would take his side and help you, and he's done that ever since. He's more than just a star quarterback. I mean, he's been a mentor to a lot of guys in this offense, hasn't he? Oh, yeah. Um, he mentors Jimmy Graham now. Um, uh, he's a special person. Um, that's a gift from God. You know, you don't get quarterbacks like this all, all the time. First quarterback, well, one of the quarterbacks I had in my life where he actually takes the blame. If he throw a bad ball, you know, he takes the blame. And you don't hear that all the time. I saw Jimmy Graham getting a picture on the sidelines of Chase Daniel. Deuce McAllister, we just had him on. He said, I got to go in there and get my picture with Breeze. Did you get your picture? Did you want to be a part of history? Did, did you take anything from this game at all? We, we didn't, I, I didn't take no picture with him uh, <laughs> just yet, but I probably all the receivers will probably take a picture with him pretty soon. Was it getting competitive? I mean, look down the road. Who's going to catch the, the, the record-breaking pass? I mean, did you think about that at all? Honestly, nobody really talked about it, thought about it. Um, I think one of the guys on the sideline said he needs 24 yards. And we was like, OK. And we looked at him and said, what you want to do? <laughs> he win. So that's our mentality, just to win. Talk about your game as of late. Uh, it seems like you've really picked it up the last couple weeks. Good game tonight. Uh, how do you feel How do you feel health-wise? And how do you feel you know, heading into the last game and into the playoffs now? Um, I'm ready to roll. Um, sky's the limit. God has blessed me to have good health. So. Let's, let's get it ready to go, get on this run. Final question I have. You add Sproles to the mix. You add Jimmy Graham this season. A lot of the core is still the same. Is this offense better than 09, or is that still to be determined? Still to be determined. Um, that offense at 09 won a Super Bowl. Mm -hmm. So in order for us to be the best, <laughs> we got to win the Super Bowl. That's a good point. Well, listen, I appreciate you taking the time. Nice to be a part of history tonight, and uh, we'll see you next week. Thank you. All right, wide receiver Robert Meacham, one of many, many weapons for Drew Brees, guys. Drew Brees will join us, and we're also efforting a few other guys as well. Uh, super night here at the Mercedes-Benz Superdome.